Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to be walking you through the process on how to mirror cast your computer over to your Amazon Fire TV. Now, this will work whether you have a Windows laptop or a PC or even a Windows tablet device. Now, what you need to make sure is that you're connected to the same internet with both your Amazon Fire TV as well as the computer that you're going to be casting with. So we're going to start here over on the Amazon Fire TV, and you can see up at the top there, we're currently on the home screen. So we're going to go over to the settings, and then we're going to go down and over to where it says network and click on that. And then this is where it's going to tell you what internet connection that you're hooked up with. My wireless router's name is 10 to 22. So that is what I also want to be hooked up with over on my computer. Now we're going to go back over to the home screen of the Fire TV by clicking the home button on our Fire TV remote. And then once you're in this area, just go ahead and hold down the home button for about three or so seconds until this page pops up. Then go over and click on where it says mirroring. And then take note of what it says underneath where it says display mirroring and then a little bit lower. It says for me, Eric's second Fire TV. This is what I'm going to be looking for and hooking up to when I cast from my computer. So now I'm going to take you guys over to my computer and walk you through the rest of the steps. All right, guys, so now I'm over on my Windows PC and the next couple of steps are going to require us to access our toolbar, some of the icons that are over in this area. So I'm going to zoom in to that section of my screen here. And first, we're going to check on the internet. Now, I'm actually directly connected with an Ethernet cable to my desktop computer. A lot of you guys are probably just hooked in through Wi-Fi or wireless, but we're going to click on the network internet settings here. And you can see all of the wireless routers that are around where your PC is located. You can see there's the 10 to 22. That's what I'm hooked into with my Fire TV. Now, it doesn't actually say what router that I'm hooked into with my direct line, but it just so happens that my Ethernet cord is also hooked in to that 10 to 22 connection. So I should be all good to go in terms of my computer being able to talk with the Fire TV to get that cast working. So then the next step is actually to get the cast working itself. So you're going to want to click on this little guy right here. It kind of looks like a speech bubble. It's your notifications that are in your taskbar area here. So I'm going to click on that. And then once you open up your notifications area down here towards the bottom, click where it says expand. And then go down and find where it says project and click on that. And then you're going to want to make sure that it's extended. That's the best option in my opinion. You could also duplicate your screen, but extend is probably what you're going to want to be selected with. And then go ahead and click on where it says connect to a wireless display. And then this area will congregate with all of the different devices that are within the general vicinity of your computer that you can hook up to for that external display. So you can see right here, it says Eric's second fire TV. That's what I'm looking for. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. And it should connect within about five to 10 or so seconds. And then once it's connected, it should say so right here underneath the name of your fire TV. And then it says it's an extended display. And then you're also going to get some new things up here. It just tells you that you're connected to an external monitor, what its name is. And then also you can go ahead and disconnect from that external display just by clicking this option right here on your toolbar. So at this point, everything should be set up and ready to go. I hope this step-by-step -step tutorial is helpful in getting you to cast your computer over to your Amazon Fire TV device. So I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing to my YouTube channel and I hope to see you back here for future videos.